We get a lot of questions by email and DM asking about how to submit music to Women of Substance Radio and also kind of why we do it the way that we do. So I wanted to explain that. Women of Substance has been around a really long time. We started in 2007. And so the way that we got music submissions has evolved over time. We used to use things like Sonic Bids and um, we do still kind of use th third parties like Broad Jam and Music X-Ray. So you can still submit through Broad Jam and Music X-Ray, but we wanted to make it really easy for people to submit that didn't have any of those third party options. And so we started taking submissions directly and it was kind of a complicated process to figure out how we could take the submissions and make sure to get the songs through a Dropbox link. And so we'd get your songs and we'd be sure that all of the members of the review board could review them. So um, the way that it works, the way we've set it up is that uh, we do charge a small fee for submissions. And that is because we need to offset the cost of the time for the people who are reviewing the music as well as the platforms that we use and you know the podcast platform and the time that we spend to promote all the music on the show so when you submit music to the show although you pay a small fee it does not it's not profit in our pocket in any way it just pretty much breaks even and in order to keep the show running we have had to charge that submission fee. And most musicians really understand that because they know that we have a heart to really promote the music of great musicians and we want to keep this thing going. And in order to keep it going, we've got to charge a small fee. So if you want to submit your music, the easiest way is to go directly to our website, which is wosradio.com. And at the top, you can click on the link to submit music there's a couple other links on the page too that you can go to to submit music. It all goes to the same place. Um, and then you choose if you want to submit two songs, three songs, or five songs. We do it in packages. Uh, one song is just a little bit too little for us to, it's a lot of paperwork and, uh, well, digital paperwork uh, and administrative stuff in order to do that for just one song a person. So we have packages and we do have uh, themed shows every year. So we have four theme shows. Over time, we tested some different theme shows and we found which ones were really popular. And so we've got our Love Songs for Valentine's series, which we've already taken submissions for. Then we have our Celebrating Motherhood show, which is all for Mother's Day. We have our Music with a Conscience series, which has become our most popular series. And that usually spans a long period of time, like three months of amazing music all about social justice issues. And then finally, we have our holiday series. But if we don't have submissions going on for those at the moment, we always have general submissions that we take. And between those series, we have episodes that usually include about 10 songs by all different artists in all different genres that we are promoting on a general submission basis. And then if we've got one of our themed shows going on, you can always combine. So say you've got one song about, you know, song that you wrote for your mom and you've got one general submission. You can combine that into one submission package. So that's how you submit music to Women of Substance Radio. You do have to be a female artist or female fronted band. If you are a female writer, but your song is sung by a male, unfortunately, we can't play that. We are promoting and trying to lift up female artists and female fronted bands. So make sure you submit music that is has those stipulations, and we cannot wait to hear it. Go to wosradio.com to submit.